From the Tenke Fungurumu mine in the Katanga, now very similar to material which came out a few years back, it's now 2023, must have come out in the early 2000s from Le Trois de Congo mine, we have a, almost a compacted clay, cluster, a clay crust and sitting on top of that we have these uh, uh, formations of Krasakala. Now, I just want to draw your attention to that little formation over there. You can see that lovely form on that side. This is a, a specimen which can be displayed two way around. But let me first of all take it like this. So it's a, it's in the middle. You have a matrix of maybe ma malachite associated with some some uh, uh, compact clay. And then what's quite unusual to this particular um, well, to the material I've encountered from this Tenke Fungurumu deposit is this velvety effect malachite sitting around here. So that's quite unusual. Then we could display it this way around as well. The colors aren't as well defined. Uh, lovely patterning on the malachite across that section. So you could have it this way. A mild powdery blue caused by the... There you can see a little bit of a crust of the, um, the, the compacted clay. Uh, the powdery blue, of course, caused by the Krasakola, various colors of Krasakola, and then the core of malachite underneath. All the way from the Tenke Fungurumu mine in the Katanga, a little, well, a, a specimen come artwork. Um, I quite enjoy this particular angle where you can see, actually I'd angle it in such a way that you could see the form of the Krasakola there and this little satiny bundle of malachite crystals over there.